Hello, it's Amanda and I wanted to come to you briefly on a topic and that topic that I'm going to be sharing with you today is God is our source. Now I stand on, let the redeemed of the Lord say so, whom we have redeemed from the hand of the enemy. My dear friend, whatever you may be experiencing or going through today, know, trust, and believe that God is our source. He gives seed to the sower and he gives bread to the eater. He also admonishes us in his word that we know all things work together for good to them who love the Lord, who are the called according to his purpose here. We have to be confident. We have to know within our innermost spirit that God is God in and through us. What shall we say to these things? If God be for us, who can be against us? We need to stand on these truths that his eye is in every place, beholding the evil and the good here. We have to be able to bind up and to loose and to know that whatever that weapon formed is, it shall not prosper for he won't do wickedly and he won't pervert judgment. God is a God that promises us he will restore to us the years that the canker worm and the locusts have consumed. Does it seem as if not much is happening right now? Trust and believe that God is a God that will take heed to your prayers your supplications and your petitions. When Abimelech was shut up in the prison, I don't have time to go through it, it's Jeremiah 39, he did what God told him to do. He said what God instructed him to say here. And as a result, they said, when you get released, you will not be handed over to the men of whom you are afraid, but your life shall be a prey as unto thee here. God is our source here. You never have to compromise with every temptation. He will present a way of escape that you can bear it here. You have to pray prayers like this. Deliver my soul from the oppression of men, and then I can keep your precepts here. God is a God that never wants us to have to compromise, for he has given his angels charge over us to keep us in all of our ways. They shall bear us up in their hands, lest we dash our foot against a stone. God is a God that watches over his word, to perform it. He doesn't care about your background. He's aware of every variable, every factor, a miracle working God, a God that wants to see you succeed. He has invested so much in your success, in your progression, in your assignment, in your purpose here. Know that God is your source here. I want to share this word of encouragement to my friend today. Rest assured that God will do what he said he would do. And these signs shall follow them who believe. I'm looking forward to hearing your testimony. May the Lord add a blessing to the sharing of his word.